Before using Sophie's mum, make sure she is thoroughly lubricated with a water-based surgical lubricant throughout the entire birth canal. KY Jelly works very well. Please note that ultrasound gel does not work at all and should not be used. One or two squirts of water can help make the inside even more slippery. Now cover Sophie with a generous quantity of lubricant from head to toe on both the back and the front. Screw the T-bar into the threaded hole below Sophie's buttocks. Lie Sophie on her stomach and slide her head into the pelvic brim in the transverse position. Once inside the pelvis, put your hand beside her ear and swing the head to the midline. Place your hand on her buttocks with your thumb between her legs. Now lift her bottom right up and push down to move her around the curve of Karis. Once the head has emerged, pull back on the T-bar while manipulating Sophie's body into the desired position. Now the clinicians can practice the various manoeuvres dealing with shoulder dystocia. Before proceeding with the birth, unscrew the T-bar. You can now proceed with the birth. 